Blast me to Bermuda. It's time for a Merlin Makes. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Mad Merlin Makes. So we've got a pretty cool little set today, just a short one. It is set number 7534 Boba Fett's Starship Microfighter. So this is the latest in the Microfighter series and yeah. It's pretty cool. It's a nice scaled down version of Slave One. Looks really good. Not totally accurate, but it does well for the microfighter um, scale. We do get, of course, one minifigure, which is Boba Fett himself. Although he does have the uh, older light green helmet and backpack, not the dark green that should match his torso design there. But it's cool we get the backpack and the helmet. I know um, some of them do skimp out on the details and then they usually give a weapon. But pretty cool. The character has arm and leg printing as well, so it's not bad in a under £10 set. And yeah, it's pretty cool. So let's get this guy built up. And then we can go and hunt some bounties. Right, let's open up our set. So, just the two bags, no, three bags, we've got a little tiny one. And we've got the newer design instructions with the clear white background of a grey band. And then just a picture of the model itself. So... Let's empty out all our bags. So let's start building Boba Fett. So yeah, we've got some really cool um, printing detail on the legs. So this is very akin to his outfit in Mandalorian Series 2, as well as the book of Boba Fett. So you got his backpack there and the head with just a single face print but we do have some back detail some scarring which is really cool we don't often see rear head detail that isn't a alternate face but we have there we go a rather grizzled boba fett Oh yeah, really good looking. And then we have his helmet, of course, which... Like I said at the beginning, the helmet and backpack doesn't match the printing of his armour panel there. So it may be a try and match it up with a bit of paint. Right, uh, where's these blasters components? It's all blending into my table here. Hmm. That's weird. Huh. Ah, there it is. Got it. It was hiding. So, build up. His blaster, and he can pew pew, bang bang, bang bang, pew pew. All right, moving on to building his starfighter. So we'll take these bits forming a cross, and we take this large plate, like a half hex. Flipping over, we've got some small details to apply. So these dark grey pill-shaped pieces, and then we are sticking on a disc. 
Now we got these orange bits for these engines. Then we can flip it back over. Take these two triangle bits to stick on there. These quarter slopes like that. Then we have a two-tier Z brick like that. A couple more red slopes like this. And we've got a flat panel that goes on there. Now you'll make up the components to help build the wings. So we get two of these, two of these, and then we just push these through like so, and then they go into A one by two with a plus hole in it, like so, and these go on just here. Two more of these red slopes to tie in there, and these nice large pieces. I've never actually had this these bits before help to build off the rest of it there before we finish off with another two of these starting to take shape taking two of these bits popping one each side like so and we take two of these quarter curves and they form the top of the Starfighter, like so. Right. Next we want two of these and another two of these. There you go like that. And these go like so, and we take these two and they fit on the inside, and we take this small slope piece that just goes on the end like so. Now we're going to be building the bottom end of the Starfighter. So we start with one of these. Put in one of these. And a green two by two. Then we take this tall two tiered Z shape. Attach that like so. And we want Another one of these, that go there. Take these two pieces, put them back to back, and they go on top like so. And then we got this L plate that goes just there. Next up, we take this piece which goes there and a 2x4 which goes like so and we build up the front of the Starfighter so we got a grey slope there 
and a single green slope there. Then we got another single green and a double green slope going there, giving that nice split design. Next we take a couple of these one by two hinge plates, pushing them on there. That's ready to attach the cockpit in a minute. Coming around to the side, and there we are, still on the front here. We take a grey plate and that finishes off the front. Now onto the side we take one of these, one of these, push them together, and then they go like so. We take these two pieces for the flick missiles and they go underneath and that is capped off with a curve on the bottom. And on the other side here, we need another one of these and another one of these. And that goes like that, finishing off. And then that all pushes into place on the Starfighter, like so. So. Next up, we're making an archway using two of these on there. And then we're making the wing, which is made from one of these quarter hex two by twos. And then we stick on another one of these flick missile clips, which goes onto our Technic pin, just there. And we'll rotate it because next we're doing the same on the other side. So build our archway and then build our wing. And there we have it. Last few components then. So there we got our clear piece for our cockpit so that goes on there and folds down like that and next we're making the missiles so we got two of these two of these little dots with the post on and then we glue on put on two of these lightsaber hilts like so. Then all we've got to do is push missiles into position like so and then we're done. Warning do not fire at other Lego people it might hurt them. Then we can put with effect in there we his gun poking out. We've got a couple of other sets in the first wave. So we've got the TIE Bomber and the 501st Trooper Pack with anti-air gun or anti-troop gun. Also got some more Mandalorian sets. So we've got Mandalorian Microfighter there, Mandalorian's Naboo N1 Starfighter, Luke versus the Dark Troopers and Boba Fett's Throne Room from the Book of Boba Fett. Hunt parts list. A flying hippo. Okay. There we go. So there we have the Boba Fett's Starfighter Microfighter uh, from Lego. And yeah, really cool little set. Microfighter range is a pretty nice little range. Scaled down, um, sort of like chunky versions of classic uh, Lego fighters and ships with a cool minifigure, nice little pocket money set, if I do say so myself. So I picked this little bad boy up at Tesco for £9, which is its RRP. 
you can pick it up at Lego, Entertainer, or your other toy supplier. So, um, I will apologise if there's a bit of audio differential between the start and end of this video. I had a phone call about three minutes in, and I forgot to plug my microphone back in after the phone call. So, apologies there. But that's it for this video. All I've got to do is say thank you all for watching. If you think I deserve it, please give this video a like. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel for more mad content. And then, of course, don't forget, there's all my links in the description down below, including the brand new Mad Merlin's Patreon. From as little as £3 a month, you can help support me and my mad content. So, thank you again for watching, and I will see you next time on Merlin Makes. Goodbye.